Hey Jesse, Phil coming to you from Carcraft Classics. Just wanted to give you a quick sneak peek of your, your beautiful truck that's 99.9% .9 finished. As I mentioned to you, we're waiting on one last part to come in. Should actually be here today and uh, she'll be ready to roll. But I wanted to give you a quick walk around like I said, and maybe show off some of the nice improvements and upgrades we've done for you on your 1987 Chevy C10 pickup. Let's see, starting up front, the brand new underhood mat, brand new inner fenders, brand new engine, nice 350 small block, crate motor, fuel injected of course, being that it's an 87, it's got the throttle body injection. See your new exhaust manifolds, brand spanking new down there, valve covers, AC's all been sealed and recharged. Yeah. Again, the new valve covers and air cleaner kit that we love. We'll buy that from Summit with the raised lettering for Chevrolet. Got the new reservoir for the radiator overflow and the windshield washer fluid. Fresh fluids, of course, new plugs, new cap, new rotor, new radiator. Brand new um, fan shroud, brand new fan in there. Basically getting a brand new truck, Jesse. It's a little windy, but again, just wanted to give you a quick walk around video here. Got your brand new US Mag Rambler wheels in chrome, just like you requested. Got a 20 up front and a 22 in the rear. Brand new brakes up front as well. You got the new rotors, new pads. Brand new tires, of course. Get this hood down so you can see. Just polished out or detailed the truck and polished out the hood. The rest of the body panels. Paint is in excellent condition. You know, there's a there's a scratch or two. There's a small one right there. Hopefully you can see in the video. But you can also see the sky reflecting in that paint on the hood shines really really well all the glass is good windows are tinted as you requested we also installed brand new gaskets all around these these vent windows new locking handles had that glass retinted put in a beautiful spray and bed liner for you the bed in this truck just looks excellent product is called a bullet liner really looks nice all right now on to the interior actually let me show you that already had new exhaust but there's your new mat your US mag wheels Good molding all around the truck, whether it's that center belt molding, body side molding, or the wheel opening moldings, everything looks great. Dual tanks, dual fuel tanks are working. The interior, we still got the factory door panels, were savable, thank goodness. They look great. Power windows, power locks, we got all new switches for you. Beautiful new dash pad with the new aluminum finished molding there. New Silverado badge on there for you. Of course, no cracks. It's brand new. Headliner's in great condition as well.
It's black to match the interior, all black and gray in here. That's your little brand new aluminum sill plates. And we pulled the factory black plastic plates, cleaned those and painted those for you. Got your seat with the cloth inserts as you requested, Jesse. And of course, we used, as discussed, that weathered vinyl. It's got some veining in it. Gives you a good vintage look to go with your vintage truck. Looks awesome. All right, let's catch up here. What a beautiful truck. It kicked our butt. I know it took a little longer than you had hoped, Jesse, us as well. Thank you for your patience, but it came out great. Again, factory door panel, new switches, tinted glass, the new aluminum sill plate. It's another shot of your seat from the driver's side. Really looks awesome, buddy. Okay, there's your new Forever Sharp steering wheel you requested. Your new gauge bezel. Let's fire this baby up. There's your new Dakota digital gauges. Gauges are working. Got your factory stereo, which I think you're planning on changing, but that's why we didn't throw any money or time, effort into that. I, I'm guessing you're going to pull that stereo. And as I mentioned to you, uh, there's your dual tank switch. As I mentioned, Jesse, someone had cut the dash to put in one of those more new style. I think it's called a single din stereo. And uh, so we had to go in there and do some surgery. We riveted in two little brackets where the hole for the stereo goes so that you could go back to the vintage style dual knob stereo. So you just pull that bezel if you go somewhere and you want to install a new stereo to just pull the plastic bezel that's brand new that we just showed you. And you'll be able to stick with your with your dual knob vintage style stereo. But there she is. She's beautiful. All right, buddy, give me a holler if you have any questions. Oh, by the way, I think I mentioned to you that we rebuilt the transmission. So you got your overdrive transmission connected to your. 350 cubic inch brand new crate motor and your black 87 Chevy C10. Let me know if you have any questions, Jesse. 770-317-1415. Thanks.